Today is a very special Halloween-themed edition of Textual Healing. Ooh, Ooh yes. Yay. And we were going to call it our big Halloween spooktacular, mm. but I think The Simpsons may have already trademarked that phrase. Yeah, yeah. I think yeah, so. Yeah, I think we just got fined for saying it. Yeah, so <laughs> couldn't use that, and it made me Google other Halloween trademarks. Like, there's Halloween hoodies... That's a candy that was registered since 1972, so we can't oh, really? use that. Oh, that for sure is a sweatshirt. Same. Also, yeah. something called Spookster the Halloween Cat. <laughs> oh, that's trademark? Yeah. And not that we were going to use that as our name, but we definitely can't do it now. Okay. So Thank we're you. just going to call this a very happy Hallow Scream textual oh. healing starring Spookster the Halloween Cat. Oh, hey, how can we get around that little loophole? Well, we just no. need to get approval from Pixar. First, oh, wow. otherwise the cat has to go. Anyway, I don't think so. it's your special Halloween themed edition of Textual <laughs> Healing coming up next. Textual Healing. Textual. We got another one of these where we asked one of our listeners if they wanted to do a second date update with us. Oh, it's one of those types but of textual nice. healing. They said no. Okay. I oh. just want to text because it's too embarrassing. Oh. oh. Wait a so, minute. Ooh, I can't wait. Instead, yeah. we need to give some textual healing to our listener, Alex. And he apparently went out on a hot date the other night okay. before things got, I guess, embarrassing for him. Oh. Alex, welcome to the show. Hey, guys. Okay, are Yo. we doing rosy cheek emoji? Is that what we're doing? <laughs> no. All right, Hopefully we have better uh, suggestions for you than that. But uh, uh, tell us about the date that you went on. All right, so, yeah, uh, her name was Ellie. Okay. okay. We decided we both wanted to do something that was, like, Halloween-themed because it's, like, kind of seasonal and fun. Okay. So, Not just kind of. It is. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> There was this haunted house, and she wanted to go. And normally, I don't do those things. Like, it's really not my thing. I don't like to be randomly scared. But Ellie really wanted to go. She was into it. And it's a and perfect I first date. I mean, honestly. Oh, oh my gosh. You don't not for think? Me. Well, no. you are terrified of I these things, do it. Jose. Yeah. I just think it's so fun. It gives her an opportunity to cling, like, onto your arm. And oh, I could see that. That's why it's yeah, probably good. You need to be the big, it, bold protector. See, I'm yeah. clinging to her arm. Yeah. You have to wait in line for hours beforehand yeah. so you have time to talk. Oh, yeah, that's a good point, too. Okay, I can see this now. Okay, but she convinced you to go? Yeah, she convinced me to go. We heard about one that wasn't supposed to be, like, that scary. So, <laughs> Did you uh, request I... that to her right <laughs> off the bat? No. Like a kid's one? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Can we go to a daylight corn maze thing? <laughs> but here's the thing. This haunted house was absolutely terrifying. Oh, like, oh no. Was what? You're it saying went... the scary house turned out to be a scary one? <laughs> Please don't tell me you, like, pushed her down and oh. ran away. Oh, God. Do you know what I mean? Uh, I didn't do that. Well, I didn't push her away, but... <laughs> <laughs> but you just what? used her as a human shield? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> what happened? So there was one part, and they kind of recreated the girl from the ring, the one climbing out of the well. Oh, oh no. no That's freaky. Heck no. I've never even seen that movie. I see clips, and it I've me seen out. it, and it scarred me. Is the embarrassing thing that you kissed the girl from the ring? No, <laughs> what? Jeffrey. No. no. Okay. How do you move your joints like that? Yeah. <laughs> Her like mouth is black. Yeah. Like, bro, uh, it's be so gross. I don't know what happened. So anyway, this girl has long wet hair, and she's moving towards me really quick. Yeah. And I just like freaked out. Like, I mean, I ran for like twenty seconds, but I look back, and the ring girl is still right behind me. Uh, oh. I hate when they follow oh, you. Yeah, when they follow you. She's fast. It's like, dude, you already got your scare. Now leave me alone. Oh, I love it. Oh, so what man. happened? I kept running, and after, like, 75 yards, I'm like, Whoa. I just decided to go out the emergency exit. Wait, you oh. just ditched your date? Yeah, I definitely ditched my date, but then, like, oh right gosh. after, she texted me asking where I went, but I was so embarrassed, and I didn't know what to say, so I didn't respond. Oh, what? what? That's so mean. Oh. That's oh. even worse. Did you wait for her outside of the haunted house? Well, I was just embarrassed, so I just went home, and... Oh. 
been like 24 hours now, so I need to say something. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, everyone in the room is disappointed. You have one person on your team. I absolutely feel this, bro. I would have probably gone home. You're so ashamed. You're like, I don't even want to say I don't anything. Think the scaring part's bad. Everyone's scared. I mean, I'm oh, leaving. Man, it's not <laughs> worth it. Do you still want to continue trying to date her, or are you just trying to say, I'm sorry for leaving you? Oh, that's a good question. Well, I'd like to do both if that's, you know, possible. Okay. okay. I don't know why men are so afraid of just admitting that they were scared. I don't ah! think. <laughs> you nobody cares. It'd be what? weird if you weren't scared. Yeah, I'd be exactly. like, that's bro, true. there's a difference for a man being a little bit scared of something and then being terrified and running away from an eight year old. <laughs> it's hard to, as a man, to fess up to that. I understand why he doesn't know what to say. And I guess what we need to decide here is. What route do we take with the text? Do we play it off like a joke and make fun of himself? Oh, I like think, that type of thing? I no, like I think angle. the first thing you have to do is apologize. You don't think? Like, own you up to it? You just left her. It's a good rule in a relationship. You don't want to start off by apologizing on date one. <laughs> I feel like that's that's a bad move. <laughs> What do you want to do then? Well, I mean, because I'm going to stick with apology, but we can go with yours. I think you can slip an apology in there somewhere. Okay. okay. But if it was me, honestly, I would probably lie and no. make up an excuse for why you haven't texted. Like, say you accidentally dropped your phone and you haven't been able to contact her. Oh, I was, and you couldn't find uh, her? Okay, Jeffrey, I love your I love I your relationship advice. <laughs> yeah. Look, Don't start off with an apology. Start off with a lie. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I do whenever my mom texts me. I'm constantly losing my phone. She thinks I'm super clumsy. <laughs> I but I swear it works. <laughs> if you're really that embarrassed about being scared, it's not a bad idea. You know what? I'm inclined to just go with I drop my phone. I like that idea. You and, do. That, and that makes sense because it's been 24 hours. So like this morning, you had to go back and, and contact the manager and get your phone. Like and it fell out of you your have pocket. to add, I dropped my phone and I couldn't find you in the dark haunted house. Yeah. yeah. Uh, make it seem like you went to security. Mm. Well, you better hope she wasn't also at security, but yeah. okay. <laughs> Did I text her right now? Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. So you could say, like, I dropped my phone inside the haunted house, yeah. and then I lost you. I went to security, and they didn't find my phone till today. I'm so sorry. Mm. Okay. You should really stick to pumpkin patches, man. Only during the day, though. Yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> no. And then if oh, she doesn't buy the lie, it was all Brooke's idea. No, yeah. it was not my idea. Right. I do I'll not support, support the lie. Yeah, it was but... all Brooke. So what, are you sending that now? Yeah, I'm typing it out now. Hey, Ellie, I dropped my phone and couldn't find it in the dark in the haunted house. Mm -hmm. Just got it back. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry. The longer you go, the more it looks like a lie. Make sure you mention, like, I went to security to find you in my phone. Yeah. Okay, I'll send another. I went to security to find you in my phone. Now we're double texting. It's okay. Some people double text. The phone wasn't there, so I didn't know what to do. That's okay. good. Okay. It's a I sincere like explanation of what happened. It's not a true explanation, but at oh least it's sincere. God. I don't know if she'll believe it. Yeah. But. I mean, look, if it was just an apology mission that you wanted to do here, then sure, we could have used Brooke's BS idea. <laughs> hey, but mine was good. You want to get another date out of this, oh so we gosh. have to come across trying to look a little bit manly, a little heroic. Yeah, no. like this was heroic. an accident. Yes, he went I searching mean. for her, contacting security <laughs> even. Wow. He went to the edge of that parking okay. lot. He huh. went everywhere except oh. inside. Yeah, he yeah. bought 10 <laughs> flashlights just to find her and still was not able to come up with it. Sometimes her. a glimpse into your brain scares me. But okay, <laughs> let's do it. I think it's going to work. We're going to sure. play a song and we'll see if she responded and continue textual healing right after this, all right? Alex? Oh, my, we lost it. Yeah, <laughs> he lost phone his phone again. again. Okay. All right, we're going to do it after this. Hold on. Thanks, guys. We're in the middle of textual healing with a guy named Alex who literally ran away screaming in the middle of his first date at a haunted house. Oh, and kept running. Kept running. Kept all the way home. Yeah, he did. (laughs) Ditched his date, Ellie, because he was too embarrassed to come back and admit that he got scared and ran away from an eight-year-old girl. Yeah. So it was 24 hours since he responded to her text asking where he went. By the way, it was a girl from The Ring. Don't just say an eight-year-old yeah, girl. Yeah. Give it some context, Okay. A, a wet eight-year-old girl. How about that? <laughs> and we all decided collectively the best move was to make up a lie, that he lost his phone inside yes. the haunted house when he ran, yeah. and that's the reason he hasn't responded in over a day. The only sense. reason I agreed to that is because he is still so humiliated and he wants yeah. another date that's the big thing he needs to get another date out of this and just saying sorry i'm a big scaredy cat it's not going to win you any brownie <laughs> points with the ladies no 
I, no, I think so. Brooke. I'll no, be Brooke big spoon like to cats. a guy. Now, I know it's been a few minutes since, since we sent that first text, Alex, but has, has she responded? Um, yeah, she did. She goes, huh, that's funny. I talked to the security guys because I was worried about you. And they said no one that fit your description spoke to them that night. I told you. I told you it was a bad idea to lie. She just called you out. She just Uh, said, oh, and she is Uh, angry. Okay. She knows you lied. I didn't think she would go to security. Yes, of course she was wandering around. (laughs) She was left by herself in the haunted house. Maybe we say, Alex, that the person that was the security guard that you asked could have been an imposter. Okay. No. 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 Jeffrey, what you do is you you say, fine, you caught me. I was lying. I was embarrassed. Look, people are in costumes all over the haunted house. Maybe he's like, I may have asked the wrong person. Maybe that was just an actor and not a real security. Security guard. Oh, yes. security guard. Yes. What, what are you going to say? Was your security guard a zombie? Because mine was. <laughs> See, now we're on the same page, Brooke. What do you think of that, Alex? We got. Uh, what? I like the idea of the imposter thing. Like, I think I'm going to say, oh, weird. It was crazy in there. True. Uh-huh. Maybe I got a security imposter. And then let me just put, like, anyway, when are you free next? I think that just, like, what? let's move on to the next thing, oh, right? Oh, I like that. Move forward, though. I like the idea of moving on as quickly as possible uh, from the mess that happened at the haunted house. I, let's focus on the second date. Okay, moving forward. Mm. And can we add, like, let's do a restart at not a haunted house or something? Yeah, or, regular like, You don't want to say haunted house. No, let's try and, like, okay. erase the memory of the All haunted right. house from her forever. Yeah, I don't think that's going to no. work. Maybe, oh, maybe okay. let's just be thankful for where we're at now. Yeah. So, well, the bottom line is I have my phone and I'm yeah. ready to go on another date. Okay. Yeah, I think let's that's see the how sentiment. This goes. Yeah, yeah, let's yeah. Let's do it. Sure. <laughs> okay, let's say that it may have been the wrong person. Are you sending that, Alex? Oh, oh my Alex. God. Yeah, okay. Um, Did you well, I like... actually, what? you know, I just kind of, I just sent that text, like, oh. you know. Oh, dude, oh. you gotta slow down. Yeah, you gotta wait until we approve it for you yeah, before we done. hit the send button. I, I got the general idea. Uh, we're sticking with the lie, though. Right. And, you know, pushing more towards another date. Exactly. That's what yeah. they say. Two lies are better than one. That's not what no. they say, Jeff. <laughs> well, it's not what they say. Okay, it's what we... Is it three lies are she better? She already called us out once. She's going to call yeah. us out again. She's already skeptical. I don't yeah, know. Now it's becoming a red flag, even more than it was. Oh, mm. red flags for Halloween. Oh, <laughs> or a skeleton flag. Those yeah. would be orange and black flags. Mm-hmm. Oh, but red from the blood. Oh, oh that's see? right. Yeah. You I, win again, Jeff. Exactly. That's okay. four points for Jeff this All round, right. zero for Brooke. Points, huh? I see dots coming. Oh, oh no. Hey. Dots. Dots, dots, dots. Dots, dots, dots. I hate when you guys do that. Dots, dots, dots. dots. <laughs> I forgot that that's a thing you did. <laughs> I wish it wasn't. Yeah, yeah but it's the only time we're on the same page, Alexis. Uh, it's what all the yeah. cool kids are doing now. No, oh, my gosh. No. You guys are so old. Are there more dots, or has she responded yet? Because we can no. sing again. No, please say Should no. I open the text? Yes. 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 Please, that please would be helpful sing. for this texting yeah. segment. <laughs> Now I'm starting to understand okay. why you kept running from the- <laughs> Maybe she wasn't right. so upset. <laughs> Text is open. What does it say, Alex? I went to the parking lot five minutes later and your car was gone. Mm. I seriously doubt you were looking that uh, hard for me. I told you she would I call like you her. out. Okay. Yeah. So do I. By the way, that lie was Brooke's fault. So we're gonna we're gonna <laughs> take my advice here. Let's say that you had to move your car. Oh my gosh. What? Okay. You, you had to move your car because I like that. there was like uh there were there were teenagers you... smoking dope on it. Oh, what? You are so old, Jeffrey. <laughs> do not, do say, not that. say that. Why do we call you young do Jeffrey? Do not say that. That's... I mean, if you were gonna lie, you would say when I went to security, they told me to move my car. That's oh. what be the lie. Oh, if they were job, gonna lie. Yeah. That's a good liar. <laughs> move my car because there were teenage hooligans smoking no. reefer. No, you were just okay. blocking an exit, Jeffrey. Uh, whatever, whatever lie you oh want to say, as long as the, they forced you to move your car against your no, will. You need to tell uh, her Alex, go you ahead. Were Send it. I we're... like the weed one. I think that's, no. I'm gonna say, oh yeah. <laughs> dot dot dot. Uh, had to move my car. A bunch of, I'll call them punks, a bunch of no. high school punks. Okay, that sounds good. Weed on it, but then I'll make it like, I'll use like the like roll eye emoji, like yeah. not cool. And, oh, then, and yeah. the smoke puff of, of no. emoji. I don't think oh, it good call, bro. That. That's the first good yeah. thing Brooke said. Send it. So dumb. Send just, it, Alex. Yeah, I changed it to the smoke puff emoji. I just sent it. Uh, okay, but not good. cool at the end. Not oh, no, cool. I sent it. Okay. Oh, geez. Oh, God. Why are Wait, you what? worried now? <laughs> you are so far into this. This is the digging your yeah, own grave no. thing. Oh, yeah. that's perfect for Halloween. <laughs>
Yeah. <laughs> she may respond and be like, I love weed. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we're in. No. Wait, or we're not. No, in. then we're not. She's going to respond and say you're a liar. Uh, she responded. Uh, okay. The I roll emoji and capital really question mark. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay. She's a smart cookie. All right. No, um, it does not take a genius to find out what I mean, happened. I, I still don't know what's happening. Okay, this is clearly not working. Yeah. No. Maybe well, we're going to fail look, at one of these finally? I, I, okay. I have normally held. What about listening to the two females in the room about what a female would maybe want to get mm. in a text message? Mm. Okay, you know what? There is a, a saying that <laughs> Abraham Lincoln once said what? that a what? good man not knows a woman. <laughs> when to admit that he's wrong. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah. It was either Lincoln or Chris Angel said that. And I'm just going to say. <laughs> I think it was Chris Angel. I'm willing to be the tall man that Lincoln was and admit that maybe I will have led you down the wrong path here, Alex. I feel like I like have to listen to the women now. Like it's no, yeah. honestly, yeah, just, just say what what Jeffrey said. Say, say okay, fine. Mm-hmm. I was too embarrassed to tell you that I was scared of a little girl with wet hair, and I ran all the way home. Oh, no. Wow. Jeez, yeah. really tail between the legs. <laughs> I mean, it's what happened. It's what happened, okay. and maybe it'll make her laugh. Uh, I mean. That's true. At, you, you could say, it's funny now that I write it out, or something like that. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to say, I'll admit, I'm sorry. I got really freaked out, especially from the girl from the ring. Mm-hmm. That's why I freaked out and left. Yeah. Okay. That was a lot of words. I mean, I don't think Chris Angel would have said that, but okay. (laughs) We're going with Brooke's advice here. Just sent it. All right. I mean, at this point, it's like, what do we have to lose? Yeah. We're, not a date. I'll tell you that. We're Did we? Uh, yeah. yeah. I think if we would have just said that in the beginning, she would have been like, ha ha, you're a wimp and funny. Buy me drinks. Well, let's see what no? she says now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Buy me drinks. We're, I mean, it's better late than never. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm bringing, doing all the sayings right hey, now. Ha- has she written <laughs> you back? Just responded. Yay. She said, look, I appreciate your honesty. But that's just sad, and she put in cap sad, and then she goes, um, dot, 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 that's the luck. Uh, oh. uh, no. Would you look at that? Uh, Brooke's uh, advice uh, lost you the date. My advice. Yep, yeah, that's what okay. happens when you're honest with women you uh, like. Never do it. That never is tell the not truth, the guys. lesson yeah. here. Uh, all right, well, it's officially a textual healing fail, courtesy <laughs> of our own Brooke Fox. Uh, more like textual reeling. Yeah. <laughs> Get out of here. All of back. So. I'm sorry about that, Alex. Happy Halloween, though. Yeah, we yeah. love you, buddy. All right. Hey, we yeah. tried. Yeah. You know what? I tried. At least I can say that Brooke <laughs> left you hanging. <laughs> Yeah. All right. Good luck, man. Call us if you ever need anything again. I doubt you will. (laughs) (laughs) 